Sierra Sierra, clear to immediate takeoff from my zero sub. Immediate takeoff, clear to takeoff to Lake Sierra Sierra. Mike Alpha X-ray, continue downwind. Fred Alpha X-ray. Lima Delta Oscar, make a left turn direct to the threshold to get you in front of that Cessna. Lima Delta Oscar, left turn. Our set. Air speed to the left. Kilo clear for touch and go around my zero set. Sarah, with you. Victor, Sarah, identified traffic 11 o'clock, 5 miles westbound to Decathlon, 1,800. Thank you for traffic, Victor, Sarah. Victor, Sarah, you clear your traffic. She's down at 1,000. Contact terminal 1252 now. 1252 for Victor, Sarah, thank you. Alpha 4,500. 4,500, Bravo, kill off. Roger, Jazz, 63, Victoria, terminal 12595. 5 Vancouver Terminal, good day. Cessna 152, Quebec Sierra Sierra, request. Quebec Sierra Sierra, Vancouver Terminal, go ahead, your request. Yes, sir, Quebec Sierra Sierra is over Point Roberts at 2,000 feet. Would like to cross YBR on our way to Camel River. Quebec Sierra Sierra, Squawk Ident and Pond 4,500, you can proceed towards the Vancouver VOR threshold to runway 26 at Vancouver. 4,500 for Quebec Sierra Sierra, thank you. Quebec Sierra Sierra, Roger, you are radar identified, Vancouver altimeter 3013. 3013, Quebec Sierra Sierra. Yeah, the information's off. 
Campbell River information, Gulf weather, 19 Zulu, wind 070 at 6, visibility 30, Campbell Radio, good day, it's uh, Cessna 152, Gulf of XDR, Sierra. Cessna 152, Gulf of XDR, Sierra, Campbell Radio, good day. Good day, sir. Uh, Quebec Sierra Sierra is over Cortez Island, uh, descending through 4,000 feet inbound for landing with Gulf. Gulf oh, Quebec Sierra Sierra, Roger, active runway is 1 2. Wind 0407, altimeter 3012. And traffic uh, 25 to the northwest for runway 1 2, estimating uh, 6 minutes. Here's a beach 1900. Copy the traffic and 3012 for Quebec Sierra Sierra. Quebec Sierra Sierra, confirm you're going to cross over midfield for a right hand down to 1 2. Road we'll crossover and field for 1 2 Quebec Sierra Sierra. Right. So 1400 is at altitude. Quebec Sierra Sierra, Quebec Sierra Sierra. And Campbell Radio, Quebec Sierra Sierra is over Cape Much. Quebec Sierra Sierra, Campbell Radio, Roger. And traffic, the beach 1900, uh, six mile final now, runway one two. Check that, Quebec Sierra Sierra. Campbell Radio, Pasco, 878, you got her, five final one two. Call you down and clear. All right, pre-landing check, primary slot, master is on, max to both. Landing light is on, have lights, car keys. And Campbell Radio, Quebec Sierra Sierra joining the mid right downwind for 1 2. Quebec Sierra Sierra, Roger. And Campbell Radio, Quebec Sierra Sierra joining uh, short final 1 2. Quebec Sierra Sierra, Roger, wind 020 at 6. Camel Radio, Quebec Sierra Sierra, down and clear on Alpha. Quebec Sierra Sierra, Roger. And Quebec Sierra Sierra would like to taxi to the fuel pumps and uh, fill our tanks and go have some lunch. Uh, is there any transient parking around here on Apron 1? Quebec Sierra Sierra, uh, you're probably better off on Apron 2 in front of the tower building here. Okay, check that. And uh, is there somebody who's going to help us out for filling up our tanks or... Uh, Roger, I'll call him. Thank you. All right, just landed here. I'm getting fuel. There you go, Campbell River. Uh, I'm gonna taxi later to Apron 2. There's the terminal, I'm gonna eat lunch and head back to Banner Bay, just building out my hours now for commercial and um, it should be interesting, crosswind landing on this baby here. Uh, lots of runway, like 7,000 feet, but uh, yeah, there's a the fuel. Red 
radio, Quebec Star Sierra is climbing through 1200. We'll be following the highway on our way to Constitution and then down to Nanaimo. Campbell Radio, Quebec Star Sierra over Constitution 3500. Uh, we'll be leaving our frequency now. Quebec Star Sierra, what do you have today? Good day, sir. Thanks for your help. Comox Tower, good day. It's uh, Cessna 152, Golf Quebec Sierra. Sierra? Golf Quebec Sierra, Sierra, altimeter 3010. 3010, yes, sir. Golf Quebec Sierra, Sierra uh, is just over Constitution. I uh, just wanted to let you know that we'll be tracking the highway here on our way to Nanaimo. Hey, check your mark for the 4000. Comox Tower, Quebec Sierra Sierra is over Bowser. Uh, we'll be leaving your frequency now, sir. Quebec Sierra Sierra, your changeover. Good day. Good day, sir. Now, even though I said I'm changing frequency, I usually wait for about a minute or two. Because I'm still technically in his radar. Okay, you'll advise for the. Uh, Maybe there's a traffic that might pop up in his radar, so he could, you know, at least try to call me again and uh, let me know. According to the VTPC Vancouver traffic uh, EFR terminal procedures chart, we are over here. There is Comox, so we're tracking that way. Once we're past this checkpoint here, because I called him over this checkpoint, once we're about one to two miles away, uh, we'll officially make, make the switch. Okay, we'll switch to the traffic advisory now. Engine traffic here, 355, Long Harbor, Prevo at 1000, left Gunsmere. Probably a, a beam Gunsmere. Right there, Gunsmere. We'll try to make a call. But it seems like all the traffic are coming from either that way or near Victoria. We'll keep an eye out for sure. Extra switch, oil pressure, oil temperature looking good. Power is at 2500, because we're buying time. Plus uh, our gauges, engine gauges per minute. My original plan was to cruise at 2400, but it looks like the engine is um, doing good, so we'll just stay at 2500. Next frequency will be Vancouver, or sorry, Victoria Terminal, which will be 120.8. We'll call them over Nanos Bay, which is about 20 minutes away, roughly. Yeah, I'm coming over from Campbell River. Uh, it's the salmon capital of the world, which, fairly enough, like my dad, I texted my dad right away because we didn't know. Right? I didn't know. After I landed, there's like a big signage there. It says salmon capital of the world. So for sure, that's going to be a bucket list destination. Me and my dad. We're going to be flying over again there, and uh, hopefully we're going to go fishing. So, I don't know if you can see the islands down there. It is actually Texada Island, and there's an airport somewhere down there. Texada Airport, Gillis Bay, I think. There you can see the populated shoreline, yellow. It's actually this. That yellow populated area. Yellow means populated on the map. So that's an indication that there's a city or town. And yeah, really I was intending to vlog today. Like actually make a pre-flight video, talk to a few students, talk to my instructors, vlog them. Welcome to Area Traffic, Harbor Express 5205, landing Buck Air Bay. But um, I, w I didn't really have any time because I needed to get a sign out. I needed to get the winds in my navigation logs. And I needed to file the flight plan, so I prioritized all the pre-flight preparations without filming it and I just went on the flight and actually on the way to Campbell River it's actually my first time going there like what I've said so I really had to navigate really well so I, w I just I wasn't really focused on you know talking to you guys because I was focused on flying navigating and that's my always number one priority I would never never compromise the safety of flying anyways Qualicum Beach is just over to our 12 o'clock about mile or so and we are right on track so after Qualicum Beach we're going to be turning to a heading off let's check my navigation logs here heading off 104 magnetic 
Uh, in a briefing room, 
I'm teaching him how to do circuits and kind of save Jason some money, diba? Sayang naman eh. Salamat, Paul. No problem, Jason. Standard circuit pattern of Pounder Bay. Ano, lipat ka, bro? Cancel. <laughs> Kaya dito kami ngayon eh. So, bro, anong gagawin yung pag nandito ka? And then, yung aircraft mo, eh, pinafollowing mong aircraft, eh, hindi mo na makita bigla. na lose mo. Nandito ka. Call my base. Call my base. So, yun. Sabihin ng tower sa'yo, okay, you can turn base now. Kasi yung traffic mo, baka nandito na. na hindi mo nakikita. What if, uh, you found out na 600 feet ka dito, you're too high for your final approach. What are you gonna do? Reduce power for altitude. Power for altitude, so reduce power, go back to 400 feet, your target altitude, and then you can turn final. What if, and dito ka, and then you found out that your airplane is too fast? Pitch up to slow down. Pitch up to slow down. Ano na tatanaw mo? Pitch up to slow down. Ano na tatanaw mo? Power for altitude. Power for altitude, pitch for airspeed.